Polaris Ranger is one of the most popular brands of UTVs. Because of the efficiency, performance, and load capacity of this UTV both on and off-road, this vehicle has gained immense attention. People have given a lot of good and bad reviews. Why would the Polaris Ranger go into gear? Some common reasons Polaris Ranger won't go into gear can be problems with the working clutch, transmission of gear getting worn or damaged, dirty or low transmission fluid quantity in the Polaris, and some unexpected electrical issues. Sometimes internal and external agents also affect the shifting of a Polaris Ranger. One such example is the installation of a new belt. Seat belts are usually made to protect people during emergencies. However, sometimes new belts are so tough that they make you uncomfortable. Also, due to stiffness in the mechanism of the belt, shifting the Polaris Ranger becomes a little difficult. Misjudgment of the belt size is another reason a belt can make shifting difficult for you. If the clutch of the belt is not engaging, it will keep coming out constantly and causing you trouble shifting your Polaris Ranger. Last but not least, misalignment of the belt and seat is also a crucial reason new belts can cause problems for you while shifting into gears in your Polaris Ranger. Now what are the Polaris Ranger 570 shifting problems? Just like a standard model of the Polaris Ranger, even the Polaris Ranger 570 can sometimes face shifting problems. The problems can be listed as poor working of the clutch system, the gear shift lever is either broken or worn out, a minimal amount of transmission fluid is left in the vehicle, the CVT belt is damaged and not at all working correctly, electrical connections are weak and faulty. For such tricky problems, there also exist some practical solutions that can be used by people even without much professional guidance or help. Check and adjust the clutch cable properly. If any damage has occurred to the cable, get it repaired or replaced. Have a proper inspection of the shift linkage and make sure to replace all the worn-out parts. Keep the transmission fluid level updated to the brim constantly. Detect all the faulty or damaged electrical connections and change them. Either repair or replace them as soon as possible. Polaris Ranger won't move into drive. Transmission fluid level may be lower than usual. If the transmission fluid level in a Polaris Ranger is lower than necessary, it may face moving problems. That is why it is always recommended to keep the fluid level constant till the required level in a Polaris Ranger. The drive shaft or chain is damaged or broken. The drive shaft or chain is an essential component for every vehicle and Polaris Ranger is not distinct from that. Even the slightest damage in the quality and performance of the drive shaft can leave very bad results on the overall working of a Polaris Ranger. Differential components may not be working properly. Polaris Ranger has a set of differential components that boost performance. However, these components need to be correctly aligned to bring the best out of a vehicle. For complete detail about this topic, go and check. Our website link given in the description. Thank you that is for the video. Please subscribe to our channel and like the video.